In this episode, Tyler gets a stick up his butt, and I show off my Trek tattoo. Oh, it's so close. Uh, oh, God. Hey, Tyler, guess what? What? All right, that was 175 <laughs> in Mexico. <laughs> We bought, when I say we, I mean he <laughs> bought a giant flamingo. I'm not kidding. Yeah. It's gonna be awesome. It's inflatable, and we're gonna put it on the water in hopes that we're not breaking any rules or regulations on the lake. We are. Which we probably are, and we're gonna see how far. He also went ahead and... No, no, no. Let's let that be a surprise. Okay. You guys will see that in a little bit. Never mind, but it is propelled by something. We're just not going to tell you yet. It's really exciting. That's so ghetto. Stay tuned. Alright, so I parked right here. The problem is, it's all... The lake is right down here. But the problem is, they have it like fenced off for swimming only right here. But over there, there's kind of buoys. So I'm hoping we can set it down right in there and take off into the lake, which technically we're not supposed to at all because we do have a motorized vehicle. We're gonna try inflating it here and then carry it on down over there to the corner without anyone noticing. This is as big as a car. It's, it's bigger. It's, Look, it's this bigger is a parking spot. All right, in case we sink, we did bring a dry sack. Godspeed. Yo, Tyler, where did your feet go? I know, right? Oh my, they're hidden. All right, it's halfway, more than halfway. We got a wing here, we're missing a wing. We're doing, we're doing the majestic head right now. It's huge. <laughs> it's it's got to be huge. Look at this thing, it's freaking bigger than a truck. It's supposed to be like nine feet tall. Yeah. So say I'm six foot, this is gonna be so three gonna be feet like, over my head. Yeah. <laughs> this is awesome. Where's your scarf at? Oh, you look beautiful. All right, we're at the side now, and uh, I don't think it's gonna fit. Look at this. Oh yeah. We have, it's bigger than a parking spot. What do you think, Tyler? Good, good time. Okay. This is actually really heavy for air. Set it out. All right. We got SS Flamingo down to the docking station here. This is what I'm talking about. So there's all these people over here, right? And it's a swimming area blocked by this. So we're hoping we can go out past these buoys where like that surfer is and just try and take her out with the, the weed eater. <laughs> this is what we went down. I was not exaggerating. That's pretty far. We made it out here. SS Flamingo. Here's the, the swimmers over here. We're past the buoys at this point. So the cops could come, but we're about to launch this, just this. So far it's been pretty successful. I mean, it. we definitely, you need more inflation than this. I feel like we're gonna sink in a little bit, but we're good. No, it's not. It's fine, it's relaxing. Put the flipper in there, right out, out the flamingos, but we got a weed eater. So we are technically a certified boat, craft something, SS Flamingo, trademark. We're doing it live, boys. <laughs> <laughs> We're still going this way. They say you can't have a yacht under the age of 30. There you go. What was that? The weed eater didn't work. Sad. Yeah. Beach whale coming. Oh, here we go. All right, boys. Day seven. We're still alive somehow, and we've been paddling this whole time. The dock master has helped us. We're gonna get a ride back. 
This is really, I'm holding on. This is hard to hold on to. It's just too windy. There's no way we're going to paddle against this, literally. Are you just staring at my butt? Oh. I feel like you're I mean, staring at my butt. I can. Now I am. Day 15. We still have no rescue. By bystanders, we might die out here on SS Flamingo. I don't think we're gonna make it. Got free rides? You have a jet ski to take us back up there? Just record whatever the f we want now. Cheers.